This is the Project Gemini Update, your source for all things Project Gemini. Brought to you by Riffical Records. And here's your host, Mark Anthony K. Greetings, folks, and welcome to episode 206 of the Project Gemini Update. Uh, Hope you're all doing well out there. This is going to be a short video. I always say that and ends up being 10 minutes anyways. Um, But this this video is mainly for the uh, UK and European supporters. Um, I've been getting a few emails of late asking where the vinyl copies of their album, uh, What Lies Beyond, the, the status of it because people haven't still received it yet. Um, those albums when were mailed in December, if I remember. I did check some of the Bandcamp, uh, the shipping information on my Bandcamp that I have for that. And uh, some of them are shipped in December, some of them are shipped in early January. Um, as I mentioned in my prior, in one of my prior videos, uh, to, to get the albums overseas, uh, with airmail, with tracking, was really, really expensive. It was like $50, $60 Canadian to get it across, which was absolutely ridiculous, and I I just didn't have that. I wasn't going to pay that to do that, especially since I didn't offer shipping at that high a cost. Um, because I had done it before where I had shifted this other method, uh, and, it had, and it's gotten to everybody no problem. It just takes a little bit of time. Uh, and unfortunately, if you don't ship it airmail to Europe or to the UK, it goes by boat. Uh, and that usually takes, they tell me, anywhere from like two months to three months to get there. Um, but I didn't realize that these guys, these guys are using, a, it seems like they're using rowboats this time. It's taking taking a little while. But uh, th- what I did find out, though, is that I did get a message, though, from one of my UK supporters who lives in Bristol, and he said that he has received his album. So I'm starting to get the feeling that they are starting to get inland now and I will be starting to slowly make their way to you people over in the UK and in Europe as well. So I just ask for some more patience. Uh, this does make me kind of rethink this whole strategy with uh, shipping albums to Europe. What I'm going to do, I mean, I've gone through so many different uh, trains of thought with this. Uh, should I increase the shipping cost? Would you guys be okay with that if I ship if I t- t- charge you guys like forty five fifty dollars shipping to get it there by airmail, or are you guys okay with it this way and just you know be patient with it? Uh, because what I did before is I did have somebody in uh, the UK who would take a bulk amount of my albums and ship them out from the UK. But then that got really expensive as well. To ship a box with maybe like 20, 30 records in it cost me over $400. So that was not feasible to do either. So it's almost making me wonder if I should even bother with vinyl for Europe or UK. But the thing is, there are a lot of you out there who do buy and that do support it. So, you know, it's kind of early still to worry about that now. But the records that this record what lies beyond has been all shipped it is in it is on the way like i said one person's already got who knows maybe others have gotten it but so far i've only heard back from one person who said that they've gotten it maybe others have got it and just never said anything or have never posted about it and that's fine you don't have to post when you get the records but uh i'm getting the feeling that the records are slowly making their way inland so that's one of the things i really wanted to address here just be patient the records will get to you Unfortunately, doing it this way by boat, it does take a little bit longer, but I, we have to weigh the difference here. Do you want to wait a little bit and pay the, the, the smaller amount of shipping that you have been paying? Or do you want it to get it there quicker and you'll have to pay more? Now, keep in mind too, I'm charging in Canadian dollars. So if I'm charging, let's say $45 Canadian, that may only be $30, uh, you know, 30 euros, or it may only be, I don't know what it is in British sterling or British pounds, but it's not that high. You guys have much better dollar value over there on in your side of the, you know, the ocean there. So 
again, this is something that I need to hear back from you guys about, especially you guys in Europe and in the UK. I mean, in the US, I have it kind of figured out here, so that's not that big a problem. But um, yeah, uh, again, the, the postal system is something that I have no control over. I mean, I've even had a few issues here in Canada this time, which is kind of strange because I usually never have it. But, you know, thankfully through contact and stuff, they've all been resolved now. Uh, and, I, and I appreciate everybody who's been, uh, you know, working through me, contacting me and stuff like that and getting things figured out. Uh, but again, your records are on the way. Uh, and I'm sure some of you have already gotten it. Maybe it's just not said anything, but just be patient. It should be there very, very soon. Like I said, according to what the postal office told me, uh, there's still nothing to be worried about according to them. So, uh, yeah, so that's what's going on there. Now, with that said... I am ready with the next record. I have everything pretty much ready. I got the album cover, the music's all done, mixed, mastered. Sounds really, really good. I'm very happy with this one. So I'm gonna. I'm thinking about starting the uh, CD pre-order for that very, very soon. But I feel a little bit guilty starting it until you guys start getting the records, because then I feel like I'm jumping ahead a bit. But I wanted this year. My goal was I wanted to release two albums this year. So I, I got to kind of get a move on with that if I want to make that personal goal this year. Uh, but like I said, the records are on the way. Please be patient, people in Europe and the UK. They will be there soon. And also, like I said, the next album, uh, What's On Your Mind, that's the name of the next Project Gemini album, it will be starting pre-order very, very, very soon. Keep your eyes open for that. Of course, I will give you guys a message and a heads up when it does start or when it will start. Okay? So I'm going to just leave it at that for now. I didn't want to make this too long a video. Just wanted to get the message out there for you guys who are starting to wonder what's going on with your records. Okay, so have a great day and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye for now.